In sitting down to write my own personal statement, I found it hard to put into words the pride that I feel when I think about the AVID students. Two years ago, when I went to Atlanta to attend the first AVID conference, I was blown away. I knew that this was a program that would shift my professional goals from helping kids learn math and passing the SOLs to helping kids dream about the future and creating a plan for attaining those dreams. Ever since that first exposure to AVID, I have dedicated myself to ensuring that every kid that comes into my room feels the passion for the AVID experience that I do. AVID really is more than a program. It is a philosophy. It's a way of thinking, and it is a family. AVID has changed me as a teacher, and I owe it to each and every one of your children for helping me grow both professionally and personally. We have laughed together. We have cried together. We have learned how to better ourselves and how to work hard for what we want. AVID is not easy. It requires committing to do more, to be more organized, and to become leaders and role models for our school community. But AVID is also fun. We have great experiences together that make us feel closer as a group. It is a support network of people that care about us and go the extra mile to be sure that we reach our goals. As this year begins to wind down and I think about going on maternity leave, I feel a sadness and an excitement that the 8th graders will be leaving Jewett. The 8th grade AVID class has planted the seed for what AVID can become in the future. They were the guinea pigs in an experiment that has gone wonderfully well and has set up a future classes of AVID for success. They should leave Jewett knowing that they were in part responsible for creating the AVID program here. I look forward to watching the 8th graders as they embark on their high school journeys. I expect to be in touch with them and to continue to support them. I have joked with them that I will expect an invitation to their high school graduation, but more so, I want to be present for their college graduation, as I know that each and every one of them will actually make it. I will miss them, but like any family, there are times that even though we are not together, we will always be there for each other. I ask of our 8th graders two simple things. One, that they will always continue to support one another and help each other shoot for the stars. Remember that we are a family, even as we move on into separate futures, and will continue to benefit from one another's love. And two, I ask them to bring their expertise in the AVID strategies with them up to Albemarle High School. Together you can help AVID grow, and you can help bring to other deserving students the same AVID experience that you had. I want to say a special thank you to my AVID kids, my family. You have grown into wonderful young men and women, and you have made a positive impact in my life. Thank you. Love always, Mrs. Jacobs.